That's an interesting point. Considering the Oklahoma loss, how do you think the committee looks at the Michigan State bad loss on their resume? Yeah, it, it happened more recently, so it's not like they have as much of a body of work to go by since then. But frankly, one of the more confusing parts of this whole thing tonight was the logic he used in explaining why Oklahoma was ahead of Iowa, but Iowa was still ahead of Michigan State. If you go by the metrics that they're often citing, which are top 25 wins and wins a uh, plus 500 record, Michigan State, to me, would deserve to be ahead of both Oklahoma and Iowa. But for some reason, and it's probably pretty subjective, the old eye test, the committee seems to put Oklahoma almost on a different tier than Iowa and Michigan State.